It is December 9th, 2021, and we still have gold rush hanging. Even though the leaves are mostly gone, gold rush is still hanging on the tree. Look at all these. Let's see if I can. Not for you. Hey, not for you. This is for me. Let's taste this. Still crispy. Still crunchy. Mmm. This late in the season. I'm telling you. This apple is a winner for the Pacific Northwest. I'm in my greenhouse and it looks like some of the Satsuma mandarins are ripening up. They're starting to look pretty good. Let's give another one of them a shot. Let's see if I can peel this. Peels pretty easily. Let's see how good it is at this point. Mm. It's a little bit sweeter than it was when I tried it the first time. Still not quite as sweet as expected. It does have the flavor and it's a little bit sour. I wonder if it'll sweeten up still. It's only December 9th. We shall see. The electricity went out again while I was gone in Bolivia and it got a little bit cold in here. Bananas died back, which is not cool, but oh well. Avocados are kind of looking a little beat up as well. whole greenhouse is an experiment so I don't mind too much if things go wrong just trying to see what will what will do well in here and what won't it seems like the Satsuma Mandarin is a winner This banana is not too terrible. The Peruvian apple cactus. No problem going through the heat of the summer and no problem going through the cold of the winter. It drops to about zero in here in the winter time. Peruvian apple cactus, no problem whatsoever. I can't wait. For this thing to fruit. I hope it fruits. Have some dragon fruit here. Dragon fruit doesn't do so well in here. But Peruvian apple cactus. Peruvian apple cactus does really well. It's blue java banana. And it's not doing so well. Citrus are doing okay. I did lose a lot of leaves. This variegated pink lemon even dropped some lemons. 
kind of sad. All the avocados that I graft on my rootstock that I call rootzilla. This is lamb hass. All the avocados on this rootstock are way more resistant to heat, cold, overwatering, underwatering. So I'm going to be grafting all my avocados on this rootstock. The other rootstocks, this was also a lamb hass, but it died. Pink Lady is still hanging. <laughs> December 9th. Still hanging on pretty well. I really had to tug on that to get it off. Pink Lady. For late hanging apples so far, we got Gold Rush, Pink Lady. I keep forgetting, what's this one here? Oh, Pilot, still hanging. Let's taste this pink lady. Pink lady is no longer crisp. Went soft. So, two and a half weeks ago, it was still really good. And now it's soft. And we hit, we had a couple heavier frosts while I was gone to Bolivia. So I'm assuming this apple can't take that heavy of a frost. It tastes like it's been frozen. Whereas Gold Rush is still crispy and still really good. The flavor of this apple, the Pink Lady, is really good still, but the texture is off now. No more crispness. So it was at its, at its peak when I tasted it two and a half weeks ago. November 20th or something like that. What about Pilot? Here's Pilot. Mm. Pilot is a little more crisp, but also has gone soft and lost a little flavor. So I would not, I would not let Pilot or Pink Lady hang this long into the season next year. So I guess that's all for today. See you next time.